my fellow smokers, it's me again. Um, how you all doing? I hope you're doing great and enjoying the, the good things in life like a sick. You know, what really pisses me off, makes me so angry, is the government. The government and hash, or if you like, the anti-smoking hitlers, is what I call it. You know, you get some really good graphic designers who spend hours upon hours perfecting the look of a cigarette packet. A humble cigarette packet. You know, all the nice colours, the fonts, etc. And then the government come along, they say, oh, it's bad for your health. You know, <clears throat> now they spoil it. They put gory images on it. And uh, things about how it's going to kill you, what it will do to you. But what really t ticks me off is if it's that bad, why don't they put government health warnings on burgers, McDonald's, Burger King, or, or even the alcohol? Look what alcohol does, you know, the effects on how it destroys people and families it's not on but anyway going back to the cigarette packet log i mean you take this for an instance look at that it's gonna kill you blah 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 smoking kills big deal the government killed them. DWP kills Ian Duncan Smith indirectly has killed loads of people with his nasty <coughs> incompetence. Yeah. Anyway, getting back to uh, something a bit more lighter. By, by the bump. Cigarette packets. So what do we do? I can tell you. Let's make our own. And the hell with the government. This is what we're going to make. Our own cigarette box. All you need is some card. I suggest 220 GSM weights. You know, because that's, I think, that's what cigarettes are made from anyway. Um, <clears throat> high tech pair of scissors and some glue. So, you need oh, a computer and printer will help quite a bit. That's right, this is what we do. Let's head over to the printer. The printer, head over to the computer with the printer. See you in a bit. Do a design on it. Be as creative as you like. If you're politically, politically minded, like um, Cameron is a wanker, etc, etc, put that on it. If you've got a little business going, why not leave your web address on it? It's all good stuff, you know. Very clever. Yes. Right, so all you do, you print it out. Okay, we'll print it out. Then I'll show you how to chop it up. See you in a minute. Welcome back. Um, I've got the template printed out. Here it is. You can see that. It comes with uh, all the instructions that you need. Um, right, I've also included this time um, to protect yourself a little bit of wood and this time this one I'm using super glue yeah, pretty strong stuff so be careful you know, I don't want to hear of people sticking their fingers in places anyway I got these from a pound shop you get three bottles for a, a pound and it comes with these add-on things I think it's to regulate how much uh, glue gets anywhere. Anyway, 
let's crack on. Hi again, Brian. This is a template. You see these uh, pieces here? Right. Uh, some here. One over here. They need to be cut out. So does the one at the bottom. Just use some uh, scissors for this one. Here we go. Oh, these scissors of a. I've got stuff. Right, here we go. Well, let's start by cutting out the template itself. It's be nice and gentle. Make sure your scissors are nice and sharp. You can actually use, if you like, a straight edge and a blade as well. Like a standing blade, but it's just preference. Okay, see that? Right, there's the uh, instructions for that to one side. Let's trim it up. And we can start cutting to the bottom. Right, here we go. Well, I'm not the uh, world's best uh, scissor artist, but I'll do my best. Oops. Oh, by the way, the templates are free, by the way. There we go, it's all cut out, see that? Right, now we need to start folding it. Right, this super glue, I've just tried it earlier, and um, it's crap. So, let's use some uh, proper glue. Right, start by folding here, see, like that. Bet you didn't know it was a black belt in origami. Then we glue that together. It's 
crap is this? So right, what we need to do now, improvise. By using a bit of scrap. I'm sure you can have better glue than this. Uh, just hold on one sec, I'll come back. See if I've got some better glue. <sighs> right, I'm back. Oh, sorry. Put some different glue, see if this works better. Let's have a look. <laughs> it works too good, I think. Right, let's put that on here. And then fold it. And let it stick. Oh, me. Yes, that was a trump. Here's a trump that old Donald would be proud of. There you go, I stuck that down. Like so. Right, let's start just folding up parts now to make things easier. It's starting to take shape, can't you? Obviously, I bet a lot of you are going to be a lot better than this. But this just gives you a good idea of what can be done. Sides. That's a bit caca in it. I see I'm not a paper ninja. It's a bit straight, a bit, a bit mucky, but who cares? Right, let's start uh, refining. Right, cut here. One here. to uh, glue these two little bits here. Just put a dab of glue. Hold them in.
Right. Bring this over like so and glue these this part here. You see that? Like so. Same the other side. And fold it in. Nice. Oh. Back up. Right now for the next part. Put a dab of glue here. This glue is absolute pants. That's what I mean. Get what you pay for. Look, it comes out like shit. Right, next part. Glue these flaps here. On that side.
like I said, um, this glue is pretty terrible. <laughs> anyway, give us an idea though. So there you have it. That's a great packet. Yeah. Now what you can do, just give it a bit more stability, with the offcuts. You know the bits you chopped off earlier. Right, you need to do a bit of measuring here. So from here to here. Hold it. Same again. This side. About there. Thing might be alright. Put a dab of glue on here. All this shitty stuff. Here you have it, ladies and gentlemen. That's a great packet. Yay. It holds about 18 fags, but, hmm, Jesus, that's better. In the words of Blue Peter, here's one I'd done earlier, with that scrappy glue. Right. If you're blessed with um, one of those plotter cutter things, um, which I'll do uh, next week on another video. You can cut these out with robot precision with it. And they're not that expensive to buy. It's called the uh, Silhouette Portrait. It's great for doing cards and vinyl. You'll do vinyl as well. Anyway, there you have it. My cigarette packets. See that? No gory images. No stupid oh it's gonna kill you. So So there you have it, we've got our own cigarette packet. So David Cameron and Ash, the anti-smoking hitters, this is for you. <laughs> Enjoy! <laughs>